Yeah, hi there. These comments are for, I'm going to just use the first letter of your name, V. Now, let's take a look at your situation. So, uh, you joined my course, I think, uh, yesterday or the day before, right? You're sending me a message today on October 10th. Uh, so in your situation, uh, you have been imp improving your TOEFL score. You realize that TOEFL is a journey. So your first score was 80. <coughs> Excuse me. And your second score was 86. So you actually made some improvements. And let's take a look at your second trial. So you had 24 points on the reading. You had 21 points on the listening. You had 20 points on the speaking and 21 points on the writing. Your next test is November 16. You got 35 days and you say you've seen the instruction for the 30 day period with a list of exact exercises. You say may you have approximately that same list for 30 or 45 days. I don't really have one that you're looking for but you know that once you become one of my students, you have complete access to all 630 of my pronunciation, vocabulary, grammar, reading, listening, writing, and speaking lessons, right? So you can do whatever you want. So after the 30 days, you can keep practicing. And uh, I'm going to be honest with you. <coughs> Excuse me. You, you need to go really, let's face it here, you need to go five or six points higher on the speaking and five or six points higher on the writing area. So you really need to do better in both of those areas. And to make those kind of improvements in a little over a month is, is not very likely. Uh, I had a student a few months ago, and actually he's not that typical, but he improved his score 81 to 105, but it took him two and a half months. And a lot of students, it would probably take them three or four months to get that same improvement. So uh, to be honest with you, I think it's going to be difficult for you. I'm just trying to, to be realistic here. I, I try to be honest with all my students. I think to try to go from 86 to 100 in 35 days, especially given the problems you're having right now because in your speaking area you're having problems with pronunciation you're having some problems with your grammar and your vocabulary with your grammar and your vocabulary either you're using mostly basic grammar and mostly basic vocabulary or you're using more advanced vocabulary and advanced grammar with errors that's pretty likely and you probably need to support your ideas a little bit better than you are in your responses in the writing area, you're having some problems, I think, organizing and developing your ideas. You're also having some problems with your grammar and your vocabulary as well. So the thing is, if there are grammar, vocabulary, and pronunciation issues, which they most likely are, it, it takes some time to work through some of those issues. So if you're asking me directly, I mean, my opinion in your case is I think the minimum, I think the minimum for you would be the 90-day. I think my 90-day TOEFL study guide is probably the best study guide for you. And don't try to learn it all in 30 days. That's just not, not the best way to do it. Because in the 90-day TOEFL study guide, there's a very big emphasis on vocabulary. You have to learn, I'm, I'm trying to help you learn 1,700 vocabulary words and it's really difficult to try to learn all those words in just 30 days. But if you take your time, you're methodical, you write the words on note cards, you start reviewing and studying those things, and you study the vocabulary over a few months, you're more likely to really commit the words to your long-term memory. And also, I think if you, if you work on solving your pronunciation, grammar, and maybe some of your word choice issues, I think 90 days gives you more time to, to get through those things. So if you're asking me, the 90-day TOEFL study guide is the best one I recommend for you, given your goals. Remember that I've been teaching TOEFL online now since about 2009, but I've been teaching TOEFL prep at California State University, uh, San Bernardino, since 1994. 
so going on almost 20 years. So I'm, I'm pretty aware of how quickly you know, students can improve their TOEFL scores. And I try to give you the average. Now, maybe you prove me wrong. Maybe, maybe you improve faster than most of my online students. Maybe. But anyway, those are my suggestions. And uh, anyway, thank you very much uh, for your uh, email. And I hope that this video has given you some useful information. And by the way, I will include a link to the 90-day TOEFL study guide. I will include that link uh, in the description box for this YouTube video. Alright?